Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine Been trying to get a hold of you All night We haven't talked in months But that's alright Was wondering if you wanted to Go for a drive I just need some fresh air And an old friend I'm so glad that we started Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Yu Yan. So today's video is all about the winter closet essentials. I live in New York, so it does get pretty cold here. Usually not in like the negatives, but still cold enough to need to really layer, need some heat tech, just some really good winter staples. So today I'm going to show you what I think are my winter essentials. I did a fall essentials video and you guys seem to really like that. So I decided to do a winter one for you. I'm sure if wherever you're living, it does hit the negatives, you definitely need more than this. But for me, um, winter does go around 20s to maybe single digits. And of course, I'm not telling you guys that you need to go out and get these, but I'm just saying that this is what I like having in the winter time to really keep me warm and cozy so if you want to see my winter closet essentials then please just keep on watching all right so i'm actually first going to start off with some accessories like scarves gloves and hats and all that just because i feel like even though that usually comes last it's so important to have some really good warm pieces like that to retain the heat so i have two scarves here that i really really like that i really truly wear throughout the whole winter the first one is this really big cozy um, dark gray almost blackish kind of um, scarf I got this one from Aritzia like three years ago and I just love this so much this is a hundred percent wool so you know that really keeps me warm and even though this was a little bit of a pricier scarf I really think it's important to invest in a nice scarf a nice hat because if your neck's cold your head's cold you're definitely going to be cold so um, I really like like this and with this I usually just wrap this twice like this um, I feel like this is what really keeps me warm and then I can pull this up too to like cover half of my face if you do want a more affordable option Zara has some really great scarves so does H&M um, this one that I got is from Zara that I got last year and I just really like it because of the pattern it's super simple but really really pretty and very cozy as well I'm pretty sure this isn't a hundred percent wool but it still keeps me very warm and it looks great with like black coats and all that which you know I do wear a lot of black in the winter time and next for hats I actually have a lot of hats but um, this is honestly the one that keeps me the warmest this is also from Aritzia and this is made with 80% wool and 20% cashmere again this was a little bit pricier for like a beanie hat but this definitely keeps my head so warm a lot of the heat from your body escapes through your head and your feet so i really believe that a good hat is super important i also have a, another hat this one is from H&M. It's a beret. I think it's super cute. It's just like a light gray beret. And this actually has 95% wool. Um, so I do like this. It doesn't cover the ears, whereas my other Aritzia one does. But I do like how this looks. It's super cute. Um, very stylish. And because there is wool in it, it does keep me warm. And also a warm pair of gloves is so important. These I actually got on Black Friday. They're from um, Express. I used to have other gloves but they definitely weren't as warm as these and I love these so much um, they have a double layer inside so this is like a fleecy material inside because of the double layer wind doesn't really get through it and I just love them so much I'm pretty sure these are still available so I will be linking that all right so speaking of accessories another accessory that I love in the winter time is a good watch because I am always wearing turtlenecks you can't really see necklaces so I've been wearing this watch non-stop this is from Daniel Wellington. It just goes with every single outfit. Um, this is their new iconic link watch. This part of the video is actually sponsored by Daniel Wellington, but you guys know I really love their watches and their accessories. I just paired it with this bracelet. This is called their classic bracelet, and I think this is just so pretty. It goes with like all the colors I wear in the winter, all my neutrals, my brown tones. So this watch is actually Daniel Wellington's first link design. And and it is new 
to their collection. It took actually four years to develop and it comes in rose gold and silver and there's also multiple different styles. I just think it's really pretty when you are wearing like a sweater or something and your watch kind of peeks through. Definitely a really nice accessory to have. I actually have a discount code for you guys and it's just UGN15 for 15% off your order. I'll link everything down below in the description box including the discount code and the link to the watch and bracelet that I have on. Um, I really love this one. This is just rose gold with the black face super super pretty and such a classic look next up i do want to talk about headbands or scarves these are the two that i've been wearing a lot this one is from lulu's and this one's from h&m this is a little bit thicker you can definitely wear this as like a regular scarf or something um super pretty it is beige with like these white polka dots and then the other one is from h&m this one is a little bit smaller both are squares um this is super pretty with the black and the browns and I really love wearing these when I'm wearing like a very plain outfit and I just want a little bit something extra I find that when I have these on as headbands um, they really add to the outfit and it's just super super cute and a nice little detail to have next up I am going to talk about some heat tech I wear heat tech throughout the whole winter it really just makes such a difference I can't live without it I don't like the cold and heat tech definitely helps keep me so much warmer. I get all my heat tech from Uniqlo. I think they have three levels of heat tech, like the lowest, the medium, and the high heat tech, which I don't have any, but it says that it's supposed to be for like very, very cold weather. But I'm thinking about picking some up as well, maybe just for like the top part, because I feel like I, I need it. So the one that I have, I have like the lowest one and the medium. This is the lower one. It is just like kind of like a basic black top. Um, it is pretty thin. This I would kind of just wear right now, maybe under like sweaters and stuff. Um, it's great for like when the weather's around like 40s. And then I have this one as well. This is their like medium heat tech. And um, both of them I got in a small. This is definitely thicker than the other one. I know you can't see it in camera, but if you do have a Uniqlo around, you I definitely suggest you go there um, they have like the samples that you can feel so you can see which heat tag might be best for you so this is thicker and this is perfect for me because I do overheat when I'm indoors so I don't like having something really thick on so yeah this is like their extra warm heat tag and usually this is enough for me but I do kind of want to get like the ultra warm one just in case I I don't know, I need it. <laughs> this has helped me so much and I really, really love this. And then I also have Heat Tech leggings. This is the one I have. I also have this in like the light Heat Tech. So usually I just grab this one, um, which is the regular Heat Tech one, like the lowest one. I know this is a little bit confusing, but I'll link everything down below so you can just check it out. So I definitely recommend Heat Tech if you are living somewhere cold. And I know Uniqlo also sells Heat Tech socks, which I really should get my hands on but I don't have those um, I have these two this is like a fuzzy sock that I have but this is supposed to be heat tech as well I don't know if it is really um, it definitely keeps my toes warm so I do like that and the other one I have this is like meant for like skiing or snowboarding socks but I wear these as well and they keep me really warm but I will be getting the Uniqlo heat tech socks soon okay so one thing I really can't live without in the winter time are chunky chunky sweaters like the one that I'm wearing this one I got last year from Zara and I love it I love the color super pretty um, I just really love like browns and beiges um, I also love how it's like a thick knit it's just so comfortable not wearing anything under it right now actually but usually I would wear heat tech but it's really warm in my apartment so I just wore it this alone so another sweater i have is this one this is like a beige waffle knit sweater this is from lulu's and i like how it's like kind of a mock neck most of my chunky sweaters are turtlenecks just because i do like keeping my neck warm if you guys do want like lighter turtlenecks um like thinner ones definitely check out my fall essentials video um i do show you guys a lot of the thinner ones that i have which i do still wear in the winter time but when it gets 
way too cold in New York, I do gravitate towards these chunkier sweaters more. So I'll link the video up here so that you can check that out. I do talk about some other pieces that are definitely also winter essentials that I'm not going to talk about in this video. So yeah, I'll link it up here and also down below if you're interested. Okay, another sweater that I have is this one. This is from um, BB Dakota, also a turtleneck. This is like a thinner knit. It's not like a very chunky one, but this still keeps me really, really warm. And I just love this like light gray for the winter time. I also have this one. This is from H&M. It's like a dark gray, black kind of color. This I got last year, but I saw that they have something similar. So I will link that for you guys. I feel like sometimes with these, because they don't have like the holes like the knits do. By the way, I usually get my sweaters in mediums because I do like them to be a little bit oversized. Okay, so I also have this sweater. This is from Lulu's. I love the color of it, which is why I've been wearing it a lot. It is more of like a cropped fit, not super cropped, but um, I do wear heat tech under this and then I would tuck it into like high-waisted pants. So it does have that cropped look, but my stomach still is very warm. I think this is such a nice sweater to have for the holiday time because like of the warm color, it's kind of like a brick red. And I love like the oversized turtleneck look. This is like a very chunky knit as well, just like the one I'm wearing. Okay, another sweater. This one is from H&M. I feel like you guys have probably seen me wear this a lot. Um, I wore this like non-stop like a month ago. But this one I also got in a medium. I just really love the color of this. I think this exact style is sold out on H&M. Them, but I did find something similar so I will link that. I just love like the oversized look and I love like the beige color just super pretty. All right and last but not least I did want to talk about this just because I see myself wearing this a lot in the next couple of months um, even though it does get super cold in New York. Sometimes I do like to dress cute and usually it is too cold to wear like a mini skirt or like a dress or something but that's when I wear sweater dresses and a lot of my sweater dresses are actually like shorter but I picked this one up from H&M recently and this is a long midi sweater dress and I absolutely love it. Um, I wore it in my casual winter outfits lookbook and um, I just really love the look of it. You probably can't see like this but you guys will see it in the try on. It is a turtleneck and it's like a long midi dress with a slit on the side. I think it's super pretty, super flattering. And I would just wear this with some high boots so that my legs are still warm and then I would wear it with some tights. I really love this look. I think it's just so classy. I believe they have other colors. So definitely check it out if you do want to wear like a dress in the winter time but you still want to stay warm. All right, so moving on to jeans and some pants. Um, I really like having like more baggy pants in the winter just so I can layer leggings underneath. So the first one I have is this one. This one I wear like all year long. Um, this is from A Gold Day. These are probably my favorite jeans at the moment. They are distressed. And somebody actually asked me like if it's okay to wear leggings under je like distressed jeans. And honestly, why not? Like if you want to wear distressed jeans and you want to be warm at the same time, like go for it. Like wear some leggings underneath. Even if that black legging is peeking through, like I don't really think that's a big deal. Um, personally for me, I know everybody is different. And that's how I wear these and I feel like it's fine. I love these jeans so much, so I don't want to give up wearing them just because it is cold. So wearing leggings underneath helps me with that. Super pretty. I think these are called like the 90s jeans from a gold day. Love them. These are like my favorite, favorite jeans. And then I think a pair of black jeans are really, really important. I have a few black jeans. These are from Zara. Yeah, these are from Zara. And these are just like skinny, high-waisted jeans just like a classic black pair of jeans i really love them i've been wearing them for like three four years now i've washed them obviously a bunch of times and they still fit amazing so yeah definitely love these black jeans i also have some from h&m which i really like as well i also really like some gray jeans these are from a gold day as well a gold day jeans i usually wear 24 because they do uh run bigger and then zara jeans and like from other places i'm usually a 25 in case you're wondering i really like the fit of these and with these i can also wear like the lighter heat tech leggings under so i do like that and like i've been saying i wear so much black in the winter 
winter time sometimes it's nice to have like a lighter pair of jeans to just kind of stay away from all black and then i also have these pair of jeans these are also from zara um i really love these because of the wash of them like i said like in the winter i wear so much dark colors sometimes it's nice to bring like a little bit of light colors and i think it's completely fine to wear like light jeans to wear white pants in the winter i know that's kind of like you're not supposed to wear white after labor day but i do it anyways and i love the look of it i think white is beautiful in the winter time so yeah this one is from zara these are like a really light wash jeans but i think they're super cute especially with like a black sweater these are loose as well so i can wear my heat tech leggings under these okay so another pair of pants that i love are these these are full leather pants from lulu's um they're kind of like a joggers fit which i absolutely love i love that they're not tight so that i can wear Wear my heat tech under it of course i posted a picture of these on my instagram and i got a lot of questions about where i got them so these are from lulu's and they are just so cute i got these in an extra small and they're very true to size um, the fit of these are just so nice i love how they fit and i love that it comes with this little belt detail just like adds an extra little touch so definitely check these out if you are looking for a pair of full leather pants all right guys so before i get into the winter jackets i do want to talk about some of my favorite sweatpants my favorite hoodies i've honestly just been living in them i didn't really wear um hoodies before in the winter but this year i know for sure i'm definitely going to be wearing them non-stop so comfortable and I just feel all warm and cozy so I'm gonna quickly show you guys the ones that I've been living in it's quite a lot so I don't want this video to be too long so I'm just gonna quickly go over them first I have this set this is from talentless I talked about these in my talentless haul video absolutely love these these are like a sandy beige color so beautiful um just super chic i love like the whole vibe of talentless i feel like everything is just so effortless just so cool i know these come in a lot of different colors but this is the one i have it's called sand and then i have the matching sweatpants and i just wear these as a set and they're just so comfortable i wear with my black puffer which i will show you guys in a little bit and then another pair of like matching hoodie and jogger are these these are from be the label which i also have a video for and i got this set and also a black one um but this is super cute it's like a kind of like a cropped fit but yeah i love this color so much like a light gray and then it does come with these matching sweatpants which are just so comfortable um i wear this to class i wear this to do errands just anything really okay so separate pieces now i have these sweatpants um this is from brandy melville this was sold out for a while but i saw that they just restocked on their website so i'll be linking that down below these are my favorite pair of sweatpants they are so comfortable inside they are like this fleecy super soft material if you don't know brandy has some of the softest softest clothing and i'm absolutely obsessed with their loungewear and stuff and then last pair of sweatpants are these these are from victoria's secret pink and they are just these like camel joggers i think they're really cute they're joggers but like they kind of have that cargo pants look um because of the pockets on the side usually you don't see like sweatpants come in this print so i really love that okay and then last but not least i have this this is also from talentless it is their oversized hoodie i think that's what it's called um this is actually a men's small but i love the fit of it it's just so cozy um the other talentless hoodie i got in a woman's medium but this one is a men's small and the waist part is actually just like a little bit bigger so it's just like a little bit baggier a little bit more comfortable and you can't go wrong with like a black classic hoodie all right guys we're getting to the end i want to talk about puffer jackets because i absolutely love a good puffer jacket it just keeps you warm super cozy and um, they're really oversized so that you can wear like more chunky sweaters and fits inside um, the first one i have here this is from misguided i got this last year but they do still have something very similar to this um, this is just like a black classic 
puffer jackets. It is just so cozy, so puffy. It doesn't feel like stuffy at all. I love the oversized hood. I just put this on and it's like, it comes up to like here. Like it's like all the way over my head and it just keeps me so warm. I got this in a US size two and it fits really nicely it's like that perfect oversized look and then another puffer jacket that i got these are like so hard to hold up and show you guys because they are so big but you'll see it in the try on um another puffer jacket that i got really recently i got it like last week for black friday is this one this is a beige oversized puffer jacket from zara i really love this one this is actually in a medium but i exchanged it for a small um, i ordered the small it's coming so i'm gonna return this one this is such a pretty beige color this also does come in black so if you don't have a black puffer jacket and you really like this style definitely check out the black one um so cute so oversized i feel like it's like a gigantic marshmallow all right so another kind of coat that i think is absolutely essential in the winter time are long coats it could be any kind of long coats like long puffers long parkas anything like that these are some of the ones that i have for long coats um this one is from zara i wear this a lot it's been in my fall lookbook my winter lookbook um i really love this one this is actually from Zara, you guys ask me all the time. Um, unfortunately, this isn't available anymore. I got this two years ago. So I know they have some similar things. Um, H&M also has something very similar. So I will link those for you guys. This is one of my favorite coats. I just love how oversized it is. Um, I usually don't like these type of coats to be super structured. That's just my personal preference. I like it a little bit more oversized. And also you can layer more if it's oversized. Yeah, I really love this. This is pretty long it comes to my knees so with these in the winter time I do like wearing another layer under I would either wear like a really chunky chunky sweater uh, with heat tack under or I would wear like a leather jacket under it or I would wear something like this this is like a fleece inside i don't know if you can tell but inside it's like fleece i got from uniqlo i believe a couple of years ago and i wear it all the time under like coats like this to keep me warm to have that extra layer you can even wear it under puffer jackets if it does get super cold so i definitely recommend like having another piece like this it is a zip up so if you have your coat open and um this is unzipped you can't even see it so i really like having this under a lot of my coats all right so another coat that i want to about is this one this is from bb dakota i got it pretty recently and it's just a very long teddy coat this is past my knees it's super long and i got this one in an extra small i love teddy coats they're totally my thing totally my vibe and this is just such a pretty teddy coat and i really like how it's long so that i can keep my legs and my butt and all that warm still all right next up we have this this is from zara i got it um during black friday as well so it is still available um i love this coat i've been looking for a black oversized coat for a long time this is fairly similar to the fit of my other my beige zara one the thing that is different is that this actually has like a belt detail so i thought that that was super cute that you can wear it either like without the belt and just be like loose and baggy or you can wear that belt and have a little bit more structure to the waist this one i actually got it in a small and i love 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 the fit of it the last clothing item guys we are almost done this one is my winter parka from aritzia i've been wearing this for two years now i love like this like detail inside this like faux fur just super super cute and it does have a hood as well with faux fur so that it keeps my head and my ears warm if i'm not wearing a hat when it gets really really cold this definitely comes in handy because it does have a high percentage of goose down and when it hits those single digits in new york this is all i wear i love this this is like my favorite piece that i got it's definitely an investment piece it is a little bit pricier all of aritzia's um parkas and everything are a little bit pricier but i definitely think they're worth it if you want something that's going to keep you warm but yeah definitely check out aritzia's parkas they have so many different options and i really think that they are worth it in the long run 
really quickly I'm gonna show you some of my favorite shoes um, a lot of them are really similar to the ones that I had talked about in my fall essentials so if you want some other shoe options definitely check out that video but um, I have these these are probably the ones I wear the most maybe these are from H&M I got them pretty recently they're just like these classic black boots and I just really love them they go with everything like literally they go with everything and um they were really affordable as well um super comfortable heel i think this is maybe like an inch or two at most and because i live in new york i obviously walk a lot so these are super super comfortable to walk in i also have these which are my doc martens um i forget the style of these but i'll have them down below um these are great with the snow with the rain i absolutely love them and i usually wear these with some very thick socks and i already broke these in so they're pretty comfortable for me of course i have my sneakers these are the nike air forces i wear them all year long because they don't have a lot of holes they are pretty warm i don't really feel cold in these unless i'm like out for like a long long time um so i do definitely recommend these if you are looking for a pair of white sneakers really quickly i want to talk about my store weitzman 5050 these i've had for four years now they are definitely an investment piece they are very expensive honestly i am so happy i purchased them because they are such a beautiful classic pair of boots they never go out of style and not only that like they're so comfortable to wear they don't have a heel um and i can just walk around the city for hours in these and they keep my knees warm my legs warm so i really really love them and then last but not least i have these boots these are from princess polly i think they're sold out but a lot of other places carry something very similar i love like the croc design and how it's like this like brownish burgundy color it does have a little bit of a heel so i definitely can't walk in these for hours but i absolutely love them love the pointy heel just super super pretty these aren't over the knees boots they are right under the knees but i think they are beautiful and if you're wearing an all black outfit i think this definitely makes them really pop out Alright guys, so that is everything that I have for my winter essentials video. I really hope you found this video helpful and I will have everything linked down below. If it's unavailable anymore, I will try my best to find something similar to it. And again, if you are interested in this Daniel Wellington watch, be sure to check out the description box for 15% off using my code UEN15. I really hope you guys found this video helpful if you are looking for some winter basic pieces. And I hope you keep warm this winter wherever you are. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys are you okay yeah i'm fine been trying to get all of you all night we haven't talked in months